In Monville, a family scrambled out of their home, forced to watch as fire took over. This noon, that home on John W. Letty Drive is just a little more than a shell. News 8's Tina Detell joins us live. Tina? Now, fortunately, this family of five was able to make it out of the house safely during the escape. They say they did hear the smoke alarms going off and the dogs were barking, but that's not what woke them up. Their 15-year-old daughter did. A scream from a teenage girl alerts her family as fire engulfs their Oakdale home. Carl Butsky and his wife grab her along with their three-year-old and ten-year-old to try to escape the smoke and flames. They couldn't get out their front door or their kitchen, so they headed to the other end of their John W. Ludy Drive home and out the garage. Managed to get out of the garage as soon as we opened the door. It seemed like the ceilings were falling down behind us. Then we just ran out into the cul-de-sac screaming my wife was screaming that's where neighbors came to their rescue providing them with clothes and comfort as firefighters quickly arrived immediately they faced a couple of daunting challenges it appears to be ammunition that was going off in the house so we had to, to protect our firefighters had to back them out and away from the house area water also ran low after the initial attack there are no working fire hydrants in the area so a mutual aid call went out for tanker trucks you know, we have to get the water teams established. Uh, we had tankers coming as far away as Colchester to set up. The water was then focused on neighboring homes to stop the fire from spreading. The Budskis' home was destroyed. The owner says it appears the fire started on the porch, and even though he's not sure how that could have happened, he does not believe it was set. I guess it's possible, but uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. let's see why anyone would want to try to burn my house down and kill my family. So. I don't, I don't suspect arson. We are back now live. As you can see, the state fire marshal is here assisting the Montville fire marshal, who is the local fire marshal here in town. Of course, the cause of this fire is still under investigation. The owner of the home says, though, he believes this is simply an unfortunate occurrence. We're live in the Oakdale section of Montville. Tina Detell, News 8.